Hi guys, welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for this coming out here. May God prosper you all. Amen. Sheo a former senator representing Kaduna South, has claimed that vote sellers are using an alternative strategy to influence the next presidential and national assembly elections on Saturday. He claimed that persons with intent uh, uh, intent to buy votes are currently gathering information about potential vote sellers bank accounts. Sani's remark came come as the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBM, redesigned the Naira, increasing the availability of currency. The activists had previously claimed that a few governors had hidden away hold Naira notes for use in vote buying schemes, but that the CBS redesign of the Naira had rendered this cash unusable. Sani claimed that politicians are not only offering financial incentives in the form of online transfers of cash to, to voters, but also palliatives in exchange for the support. Vote buyers have resorted to collecting the accounts numbers of the electorate. There is also sharing palliative in return for votes, Sani said on Twitter. Meanwhile, in other reports, members and supporters of the All Progressive Congress, APC, in Oshun State have been instructed by the party's leadership to fast and pray for three days before the elections in order to secure God's blessing and victory in the process. On Tuesday in Oshobo, the state's capital, the party's director of media and information, Chief Kola Labisi, released a statement from acting state chairman, Soko Lawa, with the directive. Since all knowing God can solve any problem though true communication with his faithful true fasting and prayer lawa implied that this his party does not make light of its efficiency with the presidential and the national assembly elections set to take place on saturday he ordered a fasting and praying session to take place from wednesday to friday he said that the focus of APC members and supporters, prayers should be for God to complete the work he has begun on Ashua Jubola Ahmed Nubu, the party's presidential candidate and all of the party's candidates for national and state assemblies. Lawa urged everyone in the APC to keep peaceful elections and the sources of the party's candidates in mind when they pray to God. His party's faithful should have their PVCs in hand and ready to use by, uh, by now, he said, so that they can fully participate in the upcoming elections. So guys, what's your take on this? Sheo a former senator, representing Kaduna South has claimed that vote sellers are using an alternative strategy to influence the next presidential and national assembly elections on Saturday. He claims that persons with the intent to buy votes are currently gathering information about the, the potential vote sellers bank account. Sani's remark come on the as the Central Bank of Nigeria CBM redesigned Naira, increasing the availability of currency. The activists had previously claimed that a few governors had hidden away old Naira notes for use in vote buying schemes, but that the CBN's redesign of the Naira had rendered this cash unusable. Sani claimed that politicians are not only offering financial incentives in the form of online transfer 
of cash to voters, but also palliatives in exchange for their support. Vote buyers have resorted to collecting the account numbers of the electorate. There is also sharing palliatives in return for votes, Sani had said on Twitter. <laughs> okay. But we know that um, as far as this country is consigned, uh -huh. as far as Nigeria is consigned, it can only take the grace of God for these politicians to stop this dirty game of giving money to people for them to vote for them. It takes only grace of God for them to do that. That is the reason why you see, you know, all of them shouting about this re, uh, Naira redesign and all that. You think they are actually shouting because of Nigerians as they claim? That is not true. All those shouting here and there, they are just doing that for themselves. You understand? They feel that the government is preventing them, you know, to get, you know, whatever they want to get and all that. That is just it. So, guys, what's your take on this? By 35th of this very week or this very month, which is a... Uh, on Saturday, Nigerian will decide whether we are going front or we are, you know, going backward. So Nigerians is now left for us to decide which way to go. That is the truth. It is our decisions that we determine the next way to go. So guys, I'm dropping it here. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Thank you.